plan. Exactly. Ma'am, where are you from? I'm from Milford, Michigan. Good to have you. And Thank your you. question? Um, I'd like to find out in your research if you came across any information about the organization um, ACORN where um, within the first year our 10 of our bishops uh, found out information that they weren't pleased with and they um, stopped defunding it in their diocese and then two years later uh, I think all the U.S. Um, bishops had defund but we haven't heard anything else. And I, I'm almost sure that this is the um, organization that our President Obama worked with was ACORN. And I haven't heard anything for <clears throat> probably like five, six years. And sure, sure. If so, you well, could. Go ahead. Uh, what um, uh, is particularly a matter of focus here, I think, is uh, that uh, President Obama uh, had uh, an experience of running Project, uh, Vote, Project Vote, which is was a uh, an allied organization to and part of Acorn, so that and that uh, became a tremendous embarrassment when Acorn was uh, was discovered to have uh, misused funds, and uh, there was some uh, of that. Uh, non-journalist journalism <laughs> that had, had opened up the, the scandal of that and became a profound uh, embarrassment to the bishops and to the church. Mm -hmm. And that began, I think, uh, uh, the process of, of trying to uh, extricate uh, from the this kind of movement, and, and, uh, and it's an ongoing process. They received process. about over uh, over eight eight million dollars in eight, eight, two thousand and eight alone during the election from so, uh, so, so from the campaign for human received development. Eight million dollars from, from the, the bishops yeah. from the campaign for human development. And, uh, yes. and then they the Catholic campaign. misused it. Well, it went into Acorn, and okay. so. It's public knowledge what happened after that because mm -hmm. they what were Acorn shut down pretty much. Uh, although they morph into other yeah, organizations, yeah, Acorn no longer exists no, as as, as such. That's it's right. now but other, lots of smaller organizations. That's right. You know, they become they splintered other, out into other under people. other names. You know, other associations. It's, okay. You know. Yeah. And so and and you know, this is something that uh, again, <clears throat> my concern from uh, the way I was trained mm -hmm. uh, and we talk about it in the video but is that we were trained to see an enemy we had to look for an enemy who's the enemy here exactly. that was the question mm -hmm. and you have to identify the enemy make it very personal yeah. so that people would get riled up enough yeah. against that personal enemy Exactly. In order to be motivated to do something and make changes in their situation. Karl Marx's conflict theory. theory. Yeah. Yeah. And it was, it was, we didn't even need you see Karl, it in, we just had Alinsky. Exactly. <laughs> you see it in Black Lives Matter, you know, Ferguson, all of that. 